Well, what I want to talk about today <laughs> is the hypocrisy that's still going on in the drama community every time I watch Jenny Jen Jen or see her channel. And if I just go over there, it only takes 30 seconds to see the hypocrisy. If anybody remembers a couple years ago, about two and a half, three years ago, I was invited up to Jen and Jen Jen's panel to have a conversation with her. And we were starting to have a conversation, but she also had the the three trailer trash girls going around the outside, around the outside, around the outside. And anyways, as I, as Jenny and I are speaking, we're not arguing. We're talking. Gretchen pups in with, with some rude insult towards me. And then Randy pops in with some insult towards me. I've got a figure skating coach pops in with some insult towards me. And when I go back at him, they turn it into why do you talk to women like that? You got to listen to the stuff they're saying. They call me a faggot, a fat ass, go suck a dick. But when I say something back, why does a man do that? Right? This is a couple, couple. This is this is how bad what it uh, was a couple years ago. But if you watch Jenny Jen Jen's channel with her hypocritical snitching ass, what she has up there is Vinny G, who's totally disgusting to women, calls them cunts. You know, behind the scenes, you know, he likes his breakfast moist. And then you got Hondo. That's up there all the time. You know, go Brian St. John, you know, you offended the whole gay community. Well, Amanda Lynn was right on your panel, called me a faggot. And then I caught a video of you called Booty Pie a faggot. Hypocrites. How's your brother? You know, Hondo, the one that hid a, uh, fugitive sex offender brother in his house that one but anyways now i'm not trying to start no shit with manda or any of these other girls anymore i just want to show the hypocrisy that's on jenny jen jen channel all right anybody goes over there you know they're a bunch of idiots if people follow that and support that because she's a hypocritical snitch she tells men in the community what they can and can't say to women but allows hondo and yokum sometimes and uh vinnie g on her panel to say whatever they want about women so i just wanted to play this clip real quick let me show you first let me show you something now this is going on right now okay on jenny jen jen's channel you notice the first i want you to see you know this is what he's up there. Hard dicks insider bum shell, rotten old bunghole. He's talking about a woman. It doesn't matter if Jenny Jen Jen doesn't like her. It doesn't matter if Hondo doesn't like her, right? She's still a woman. And this is what he gets to sit up there with that name, you know, while making jokes and stuff. Um, ugh, Vinny and her. No, sorry. I had to spray him with cold water just to keep them off of each other. Down, down, you disgusting, vile pigs. Down, down. <laughs> okay, so since that took two hours. That's almost always what Hondo talks about on her. He's degrading women constantly. Okay, I just wanted to give you a show of that. And then I want to show you this a clip that I had from a couple years ago. When I had, you know, it was one, two, three, four women against me. And I went up there with all intentions of just speaking to Jenny. I wasn't mad at her. She wasn't mad at me, but we had an issue. We needed to straighten up. It was until the, they don't, this doesn't play the whole context of the clip, but Jenny and I are talking calmly to each other. And then these other dumbass bitches jump in it. And, and then I defend myself just because I'm a man doesn't mean I don't have to, I have to listen to that shit. And it, I think it's funny, you know, as much as I'm so happy for Amanda and Hooker, you know, I'm so I'm very happy for it. I like to see anybody find happiness, and I support that, and they got it. But she's in there calling me a faggot. Anyways, let's have a listen. You're embarrassed. That's why you want it down. I'm not embarrassed. You shut your ass. I'm not embarrassed. You disrespect. You I showed three. my ass. Shut your what? mouth. I am talking. You I shut your the... fucking mouth, bitch. I ain't no. talking to you. Wait, 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 guys. Come on, please. I can't know exactly what I'm talking about, Brian. You think you can talk to Marianne. You think you can talk to any other female on this panel but the three. You notice I was talking calmly. 
All right, and I'm a, I, I, you know, I'm a fifty plus year old man. I'm not gonna have somebody tell me you shut your mouth. That's what Gretchen. That's how it started. Okay, Gretchen said you shut your mouth. Yeah, I was talking calm enough. Yeah, you know, I don't have to put up with that shit from these fucking bitches. I don't. You shut your mouth. She said. I'm gonna go back to that real quick. You can talk to Marianne. You think you can talk to any other female on ass. I'm not embarrassed. Disrespect. You I showed my ass. Shut your what? mouth, I am talking. You sh- Shut your mouth, I am talking. Fuck you, bitch. You know what I'm saying? Disrespect. You I showed my ass. Shut your what? mouth, I am talking. You I shut your the- fucking mouth, bitch. I ain't talking to you. Wait, 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 guys. Come on, please. I can't. I don't know. That's exactly what I'm talking about, Brian. That's exactly what I'm talking about, Brian. If some female says, you shut your mouth, you'll snap back at him. The fuck can make me shut my mouth, bitch. You can talk to Marianne. You can talk to any other female on this panel but the three men on it. Well, guess what, motherfucker? You think you can talk to. A uh, woman, any way you want, after she just told me you shut your mouth. And then, guess what, motherfucker? Yeah, yeah, I think so. I really do think so. I got balls bigger than yours. I dare you to come at me with some of your bullshit. Go ahead and unmute. I bet you I can talk louder. I, you want to yell all you want to? We kick that in a good part. I'll go outside and like, I'll Fuck you. I'll How about that, cunt? cunt? Oh, do you think my feelings are hunt part that you call me a cunt, Brian? Guess what? Guess what? I call myself the cunt. But you know what? You but I'm not talking to you. I'm to talking to Jenny. Me. I, I came up here to talk not, to Jenny and you took your two cents I'm talking to you. Shut your mouth. I don't give a fuck you. what you got to I say. Uh, uh, Brian, you're going to put disrespecting my you. friends that are women in this community. Piece of fucking trash. That's all you do. All right, here comes Miss Amanda Lee. Which we're in a good place today. I'm going to keep it that way. I'm just bringing this back. I'll show the hypocrisy. That's my thing in the drama community, showing the hypocrisy. And I've been very good at it. I've just been in on low key. But I want you to listen to Amanda here telling me how I shouldn't talk to women the way I do and have. And, rem- and remember, the whole time, Hondo's sitting up there on her panel now wishing a hard dick in in uh, Bommy's butt and saying that she has a rotten old bunghole in writing. Okay. And it's not about Manda and it's not about Gretchen. It's about Jenny. Okay. How, how fake she is. She's fake. <coughs> so listen here. Listen. I'm not talking my friends that are women in the community. Piece of fucking trash. That's all you do. See, she just got done saying, look at the way you're talking to my friends, the women in this community. And then she goes on with cocksucking faggot. Hondo once told me that I was, since I called somebody a fag somewhere along the line, I just, I upset the entire LGBTQ community by saying that. But but listen, I shouldn't talk to women a certain way, but they can they can do this. You're pushing me to a point that I don't fucking like to be at. You've disrespected every I single one of my What you got to say, you fat, stinking bitch? How about that? Brian, you got to say me besides Pam. Hey, look, I came up here to talk to this Jenny and somebody started on me. Video. How about they okay, shut well, the fuck up and let me talk to Jenny? Okay, but Brian, don't maybe this isn't the time or the place. Can you talk to Jenny right. offline somewhere? Jenny doesn't fucking answer me. Well, she Whoa, maybe don't want to talk to you then, okay? Let me know. Listen. That she's my friend and she wants Ron to said John. Ron. 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 Fuck Gretchen and fuck Ron. 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 Stop it. Ron. Ron. Stop it. Stop. Wow. 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 Wow.
Brian, stop. Brian, do you really and truly, hey, what are you doing? Hey, Brian, hey, what are you doing? I'm missing you. I was lying to Jenny until this bitch who told me that she would get the captain of the to help me with Ralph. Now, listen, listen to figure skating. Brian, what are you doing? Brian, what's up? Brian, watch what you're saying, but she does not address Amanda at all. Cocksucking faggot. She doesn't address Amanda at all, and I call her on it. A human being. Dumb bitch. Brian, Brian, Brian stop. Brian, oh my Brian, gosh, Brian. what are you oh, doing oh, to yourself? Yeah. And what are I you came to talk to Jen. No. You can't call somebody a cock sucking faggot and expect that they just sit there and go, oh, okay, yeah, sure. Yeah. We've been listening to the voice of reason of figure skating coach. Not Gretchen and not Amanda's fat ass. My name is. Am I muted? <sighs> no, we hear you, Randy. Can anyone hear me? Randy, I hear Brian, you. Brian, you going after females, Brian. Okay, can I speak? Oh, bitch, you fucking, you, you talk a female, you talk about suck a dick, fucking Brian, Brian, stop, Brian, stop it. Fuck you your husband. Now, they accuse me of going after females. Right? But what started this, again, was some probably 30-year-old woman telling me, you shut your mouth. How would you feel if anybody came up to you and told you, you shut your mouth? I'm like, fuck you, shut me up. That's how it started. Now, is that me going after women? I didn't come up on that panel like that. Mm -mm. They don't show the clip where me and Jenny are just talking for a little bit, and then they somebody stuck their nose in. I told her I wasn't talking to her. So she's dipping in the cup when she don't know what's up. She's flipping in and flapping when she don't know what's happening. Can I please, ladies, can I please talk to Brian for a second? I don't know. I was trying to I've been Brian, but no, I was trying Brian. What what are I know you respect me. Brian, what I'll give you respect. I came in here to talk to Jenny and I was calm until Gretchen came in here running her mouth. Brian. But how you speak to women, you've got to stop How these it, fucking Brian. women speak to me? Oh, Fuck that God. crap bitch that told me to go suck a dick. They were threatening me, telling me to shut the fuck up. Go ahead and mess with me. You big blah, blah, blah. Go ahead and mess with me. Jeez. These are... I, I'm glad that I pulled myself away from this fucking bullshit. I still want to address this. Listen here. Fuck her ass. And remember, Hondo's sitting up there like this. You know, figure skating coach is a mod. She's a friend of Hondo. Now, why don't we see Hondo going, or figure skating coach right now jumping up there going, Hondo, you really should take that down. Why are you talking, writing things like this about women? Where's that? Where's that? Oh, God, that's what I mean, God. You can't you can say it to me. She can say it to me. Yeah, you know, say it to me. No wonder you was in an abusive relationship, bitch. Do you want me to talk? Oh, my gosh. I'm in an abusive relationship. I can't. I can't. That's right. No wonder you're in an abusive relationship because if she'll tell a stranger, I mean, somebody that she doesn't know, or call him, like, you know, like, suck a dick. Sucker. If she was doing that to a man in their house, I mean, if she continued to do that, I mean, you, that creates an abusive relationship. Actually, when Amanda is yelling at me like that, and we were friendly, we were good and friendly for a long time, but when she was saying that to me, when you're friends, you're having a relationship. It's not a sexual relationship, but it's a relationship. And when me and Amanda were friendly, uh, you know, we, we did we had a friendly relationship, all right? So when she starts telling me suck a dick, call me a fat ass, she's the abuser. <laughs> but anyway. Oh, what the fuck is that to you? What the 
like, what the fuck is that to you, Brian? Oh. I knew that they were like a 15. Brian, you better shut the fuck up. What? Would you go do what? I come what? up here and told you that the you reason that you want the video I, But I'm not talking to you, man. I don't yeah, give you a go fuck yelling what you have to say. I'm talking to you. I don't give a fuck about nothing to flip-flopping motherfuckers. None of you. Jenny, you pretended to be my fucking friend. You're, you turned into a fucking asshole, so then, yeah. I'll I turned into an asshole because people are trying. Well, you don't make a comment about I can't I, even I understand my you because your audio. I have shit about your kids. I don't give a shit about your kids. You did so, bitch. I saw you it. literally have spit flying out of your mouth, Brian. Can you calm down? What sure. Yes, Brian. Can please Brian, please 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 calm down. Can I talk to Jenny? I'm here to I'm here to to Jenny, motherfucker. Please. But We're not in. You come on, you're coming so hard at everybody, and I don't think this is the time or the place. No, 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 Wendy, I appreciate your advice, but I wasn't coming hard at nobody. I came to talk calmly to Jenny. Now, you notice that Wendy was talking to me calmly and with respect, even though she was more worried about me responding to people at the same time and suck a dick and, and all this stuff. And figure skating coach was also speaking to me with respect. That's how I return speaking to them. Okay? And you can see that all through this video. Stroke. Okay, okay. but Stroke. I hear you that, that maybe that was your intention, but as soon as you get up here and there's all these people up here that clearly you have a problem with. I didn't have a problem with any of those people that were up there. No. Until they butted in on my conversation that I was having with Jenny and they were rude about it. Jenny wasn't being rude. She invited me up. Told her in the chat, like, can I, let's talk it out. That's my intention. I don't you have a problem with Gretchen. Oh, okay. Well, there's others up here that you clearly do I have a problem with. I don't have a problem with Amanda. It, she, it doesn't, it doesn't matter who you don't have a problem with, with Brian. Fuck Listen you, to Brian. Brian. Fuck you, Brian. Fuck you, Brian. You, Brian. Fuck you, Brian. But is this not a conversation you can have privately with Jenny? Does it have to be here? No, Je no Jenny offered me to come up. And I started to talk to her calmly. And other people start putting their input. I don't have to take this shit from nobody. Brian, nobody says you have to, but please don't go after these women like I'm this. I'm not going after them. She came oh after my God. me. Brian. I'm responding. Tell her to shut I, the fuck up. Brian, please, calm down. You are going to have a heart attack. Calm down. Well, the, thing, the, the thing of it is, I, of course they were making me angry because they were not trying to fix the issue. The issue is these women... While I'm in a conversation, decided that they wanted to jump in it and be fucking rude. Period. So I got rude back, and then they got rude again. Nobody addressed the women. All right. And the thing of it is, is figure skating coach should have said, "Hey, Brian, that's you know inappropriate." But you should say, "I understand that you were provoked, and that's inappropriate too." How about we all just stop and talk like adults without the insults? No, they didn't try to fix. All, all while Hano sitting up there with this. Just calm down, yeah, please. Yeah, I, I talked to you right. without anybody interrupting. Yes, I'm, I'm muting. Please talk to Brian for a second. I That's, can I talk to Jenny without interrupting? And then they did for a minute. Randy, me and Randy were having a little spat back and forth, but that's, uh, I never had issues with having spats with Randy because she's part of the drama community and she does drama really well and she don't take it personal. She really don't. It's just part of the show when it's me and Randy. That's the way I feel. There's certain ones in the drama community, you know, where we were arguing back in the day that it didn't bother me that we were arguing because it was just, you know, like with me fighting with Laura and it was intense when we were fighting with Laura, but it's drama. That's what we were here to see. So some of it was played out and played up, scripted, right? But but the ones that can handle it, like, you know, Randy can handle it. She's got a thick, thick skin. She tried to burn me a couple times, and you know, I tried to burn her, and it was fun. That was fun drama. Okay? It wasn't at the time, but it's really it was really good drama. You know, they can handle it. But if these people are talking to me with respect, I do the same to them. You can see that in there. But I just wanted to show the hypocrisy. Let's just click over here. A lot of people are going to get pissed off, but hey.
Sistema da 